Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another fake up series and today we are going to review this fake palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills Moon Child Glow Palette. This palette is really trending because it has a very good highlighters which are holographic and holographic makeup is everywhere these days people are experimenting with their lips eyes highlighters blushers and whatnot even yeah the nails also and uh, that is why this palette is really um, famous among all the beauty gurus because it's great to experiment with the holographic makeup and let's talk about the packaging first and yeah i would like to tell you i bought it from the one of the instagram seller and i'm gonna link down the seller's details under the description box so in case you are interested you can check out and let's look at the packaging first the packaging is really beautiful and if you look at it you cannot make out that if it is a a fake one or it's a real one everything is written so beautifully there is no spelling mistakes or anything of that sort and I have seen the real palette and it looks exactly similar to that at the back side of it you can see uh, it has a name it's called the moon child glow kit at the back side of it it has all the shade names and also the ingredients listed under each and every shade so that is something really good then it has the expiry date and everything and clearly you cannot make out if it is a fake palette or the real one so that is something packaging wise i really like uh, there are no flaws in this one and when you open this palette it looks like this again a very holographic kind of packaging and uh, quite sturdy there are no flaws into that one and whatever you saw on this packaging the same goes on the real packaging that is how it looks and let's open the palette and this is how the palette looks like it has six shades and it has the Anastasia Beverly Hills and logo everything on this part of the packaging and um, once you remove the film these are the six shades that you get to see and they are quite identical to the real one as you can see clearly and closely and all the shades are named very well there are no mistakes done on the shade names or in the ordering the first shade is called the blue eyes the second is called the star it is a very grayish kind of highlighter the third one is the third one is called the purple horse show and then it's called pink heart lucky clover and last is the blue moon i'm gonna swatch all the six shades on my hand so that you can see how pigmented they are whether they really have any kind of holographic effect under these ones and also i'm gonna put it on my face as well so you can see whether they are picked up by the brush or not and how good or bad they look on the skin obviously these shades are not the most wearable highlighters obviously you'll think twice before wearing such shades and going out in public if you are not someone who loves to experiment and play around with the makeup so these are not a very safe kind of highlighters and also since all the shades are really cool toned ones they go very well with the lighter skin and also if you are blessed with the dusky stain these shades gonna look absolutely stunning on you in terms of the holographic effect so if you are daring enough for the experiment then this palette is definitely meant for you i'm not talking about the fake one i'm talking about in general the anastasia moon child glow palette then it is meant for you but if you are someone who loves to go only with a small glow highlighter golden kind of highlighter then this palette might disappoint you yeah so let's just swatch all the six shades on my hand and i'm going to talk about all the shades as well let's swatch this blue icy so when i rub my finger on this one they feel really soft really soft and i'm not kidding look at the color and it definitely has a lot of holographic effect let me swatch it it feels very powdery very buttery and so simple to blend and this is how the color looks like i hope my camera is picking up but this color definitely has a lot of shine to it and definitely when i move my hand like this you can see a lot of glow going inside this particular shade so these kind of shades make it really perfect you want to place it into your inner corner of your eyes they just instantly vibrate enough your entire eye makeup look and 
when I move it in the sunshine or something, I can clearly see a lot of bluish purplish kind of effect in this shade that makes it absolutely stunning. If I forget about this is a you know this is a fake palette, I'm definitely digging this particular shade a lot because I love how beautiful it looks. So this is the first shade and it's called Blue Eyes and look at it on my finger. You can see a lot of sheen, a lot of colors going here and there. Now let's swatch this second shade which is called Star which looks quite grayish and it has a little green effect to it. Not sure if can be visible in the camera but again super pigmented, super glowy and absolutely stunning. I love that this palette is a beautiful copy of the original one but having said that I'm not promoting the fake makeup at all this is just about reviewing some of the fake makeup which is out there in the market whether they are a good copy or not but so far I'm really impressed with the kind of pigmentation product texture and everything it's absolutely absolutely stunning now this is a shade called purple Ro purple horse shoe yeah let's just swatch it yeah this is the purple and it definitely has a lot of pink and purple going inside this one and it looks absolutely beautiful it's a very holographic kind of color yeah i think now you can see how beautiful these shades look you can see a lot of sheen a lot of glow going inside these shades because now my hand is actually in contact with the sunlight and when i move my hand around like this you can see a lot of you know colors moving here and there so this was the purple horseshoe the next shade here is called the pink heart which is again a very white base shade but they say it's a pink heart i'm expecting some of the pink effect to it let's swatch it here yeah it has a rose gold effect to it wow this is so stunning as i already said all the shades are very cool toned ones so not something very wearable on a daily basis absolutely true but just look at the technology the method going behind all these colors it's so stunning absolutely stunning this is called the pink heart if you are a rose gold lover you will definitely love this shade now the next shade is called the lucky cover which is a very silverish white shade and that is how the color looks like all the shades have some kind of different color texture to it and this is oh it's not silverish actually it's it has a very very pale yellowish tone to it some greenish yellowish tone to it so this is the shade called lucky cover let's move on to the last shade it's called the blue moon and again super soft and it again has a lot of purple bluish tone going to this one i'm not sure if you guys can see the difference in all the six shades because they might look very metallic and very icy kind of shade to you but in real if you look at it all the shades have very different color texture to it some are purple the next one has a lot of you know silver tone added to it third one is more about the purplish and bluish this is all about the rose gold this is like a minty green effect it has and this has a very icy blue effect to it so these are the swatches of all the six shades that comes in this moonshine palette i absolutely love all the six shades i mean if it was a real palette i would have recommended to every single person out there who loves to experiment with their makeup but since it's a fake one i really cannot recommend it to anybody because we really don't know what kind of ingredients are going about inside this palette but if you are not concerned about this one it's up to you yeah i leave it to you but these are the swatches of all the six shades i'm absolutely loving this particular palette i hate to say that but i am 
it is definitely a very wonderful copy of the Anastasia Moonchild Glow Kit. There's no doubt in that one. And this particular palette cost me under 1000 rupees, I believe, but the price keep on changing. So if I bought it for about, you know, 800 to 10, uh, so if I bought it for a piece around 800 to 1000 rupees and you buy it now, you may get it for a higher or for the lesser price. So you have to check out your sale. There are so many sellers out there in on Instagram who are selling such copies, but I would definitely let you know the seller name from whom I bought it because the experience was good. Let's just put on some of the color in the uh, inner corner of my eyes and also something on my cheek as a highlighter just to see how they exactly look on the face. So here you are up and close and I think I'll go for um, this particular shade. It's called the Purple Horse Shoe and I'll place it in the inner corner of my eyes. So when I take my brush and dip it into the palette, it picks up very well. Please excuse my dirty brush, but let's see. Ooh, it's very, very, very pigmented and it's, there is no challenge in placing such colors in my inner corner. So now my eyes have a little unicorn effect, which I love. Let's place this pink heart since it's more of a rose gold shade and let's put it on cheeks. Just start swatching it. I'm not sure if it's gonna show up on my skin considering I belong to the fair to the medium one, but I still hope that when I move my face, around it's gonna show up wow i can see it in my mirror i'm not really sure what kind of lighting effects are needed so that you guys can clearly see the pink the rose gold effect going on top of my cheeks let me go a little more with this shade so that you guys can see the color effect uh, yeah now you can see Oh my god, this shade is stunning, absolutely stunning. Let's try another shade here. I may look like a clown but I don't care because I want to give you every single detail about this particular one. Let me know which shade you want to see out of this one. Let's try this last shade which is called the Blue Moon because that is something a very vibrant shade and let's just put it on on the side of my cheek. Oh yeah wow this is probably very stunning it's better than this particular one but let's look at the sheen wow it's absolutely beautiful guys seriously if you want to invest in a very dramatic makeup palette, this is something for you. Go for a real one. Obviously, I'll not suggest to go for the fake one. Go for the real one. It is a little costly, but you would get the most stunning holographic effect on your face. Using this palette, it can be used in multiple ways. You can dust this color on top of your lips. If you want a little holographic effect, let's just try that one also. And you can play around with this palette on your eyes, on your cheeks, and why not? Wow, I love this palette so much. And that definitely made me buy a real one. Let's just dust some shade. Let's dust the shade called Blue Eyes, the first one. And let's just dust it a little bit on my lips. Oh my god. It has a lot of holographic effect going. So yes guys, this is definitely not a most wearable makeup look that you would go out there. But I wanted to try out this palette in different ways which is why I wore it on my cheeks, on, the, on my eyes, on my lips and everywhere. 
and what I think about this palette is it's definitely a wonderful copy of the Anastasia Moon Child Glow Kit. There is no single doubt in that one. Look at the swatches of all the six shades. They are absolutely stunning. I never thought that I would come across with this kind of great copy of any palette invest in the real palette if you really want to experiment with a lot of holographic makeup so that finishes my review on the fake version of the anastasia moon child cloak kit i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video please make sure that you have hit the subscriber button so that you will never miss out any fake up series that goes on my channel so yes guys thank you so much for watching and i'm gonna see you in my next video till then you take care and bye bye